India, every yoga school free. I never spent one penny, 21 years to go to college. It's free. It's free. But America, wow. When you know, you must do what Roman does. So first six months, I taught yoga in Beverly Hills. Guess how much I charge? Not a penny. My guru's order, India's order, you cannot charge the money. Guess who is coming? The dirty kids and dirty people and dirty people. People. So all the movie star of my student, from Elizabeth Taylor to Shirley MacLaine to you name it, hundreds, Quincy Jones, they said, boss, when you is Rome, you must do Roman does. Your principal write for your country, India, not for America. The people coming in your class, we cannot come. I said, well, what is the solution? What do you want to do? You have to charge the money. I said, why? I'm teaching you free, like India. Why you want to pay the money? Think of it. He said, the whole class is smell like it. They don't take shower. Their clothing is so bad. They're so dirty. They're folding in the class. We cannot come. Then I said, okay, Charlie, you run this class, the, the yoga exercise, the office, I'm out. So I don't want to feel guilty conscious that I break the law of India as a yoga guru. No, you are right, Vikram. We agree with you. We understand. We have respect and love for you. But this is not Calcutta. This is Beverly Hills. buy socks for $30. This is this is a different country, different culture. I didn't agree, but I said, you run the school, I just teach it. Guess what? 74, one class, how much you charge? They charge, not me. Can you think? $25. There was a yoga school in Santa Monica, near the beach. A Japanese teacher, but born and raised in Los Angeles. He used to teach yoga. Guess how much he used to charge? Two dollars per class, one hour. One hour class, two dollars. And movie stars of Hollywood, they paying twenty-five dollars per class in 1974. 50 years ago this month. Think of it. And they pay yearly, six months, 30 days. No problem. When you in Rome, you must do what Roman does. This is not Calcutta.